are students at Anna Wittlachs High School, and our school cafeteria differs a lot from many others. In most schools in Sweden, meat is served several times a week. However, at our school, uh, students are offered a variety of vegetarian and vegan options. And meat from cow, pig, lamb and chicken is not on the menu. And vegetarian food can often be associated with boring food, but that's not the case. Now is it, Maria? No, we are served a wide range of organic, colorful and fresh food, all made from scratch. And as students, we appreciate the thought put into our meals. And we also think it is only natural that vegetarian food is the default option in school, a place where we trust science, where we're told that red meat does have a bad effect on the climate. Yes, we as students feel as if we make a difference together. Uh, in our school, they serve us. Um, in our school cafeteria, they uh, give us an option to, together, all 2,000 students of, uh, of us, during lunchtime, make a difference. Yeah. And if we're going to solve the climate crisis, we need to act on every level of society. And in our school cafeteria, we work with how the individual can affect if we join hands. Mm -hmm. The small choices we make not only change our daily life, but in the end, our way of life. Yes. To us, it is a given that our, if our school books tells us that red meat has a bad effect on the climate, then we should get the same message from our cafeteria. And school is supposed to be a place for innovation and trying new things. Therefore, we want to give love to Anna Whitlock's high school for daring to take a stand for the better of the planet. So please agree to our campaign to encourage more schools to take a stand. Thank you.